let's say Mexico, if it's between the US and Mexico. So one idea that's been uh, around, uh, it's, it's widely associated with Ripple, but it's not only associated with Ripple, is this simple chart. What if I move fiat to crypto and crypto to fiat? Is this called a bridge crypto or bridge currency? I can sort of say I can go from US dollars to Bitcoin or XRP, you, you, you fill in the middle and then move over to the other fiat, uh, Mexican peso in my example. Um, and might that take some cost out of the system? We have Sean's issue earlier of volatility. If the crypto is fluctuating a lot, that, that causes some issues. If there's a lot of cost or friction, because now you're doing two currency exchanges, not one. I'm calling crypto a currency for this purpose. I know that crypto is not technically a currency, uh, but, but for this moment, let, let me just call it, you have two currency exchanges, and thus you have uh, two bid-ass spreads to pay, just the market makers, you need to pay the bid-ass spreads twice, and you have some volatility if the middle crypto is moving around. But this simple diagram is a big part of what Ripple is trying to create with X Rapid, right? X, X Current is a messaging app of Ripple's, and it's competing with Swift. And, and, and it has some reasonable adoption. A lot of banks are starting to use it. But don't confuse that <laughs> with another product, which is an interesting product that kind of does this, that goes fiat to crypto, crypto to fiat. So what problem, what pain points would this be solving if it worked in, in the um, cross-border? Anybody want to remind the class what the, Tom? Plus well, reduces the number of intermediaries. You don't have to have your bank engage with a correspondence bank, which engages with a local bank, which then, it, it, Sort of All right, so it might, I'm going to say it might lower the intermediation uh, because you still have on the two fiat sides, two, a bank, a local bank and a bank, and to do the crosses, you need some market making function, which in Ripple's case, they try to build into the application, and they have market makers to provide liquidity. There was a question, somebody mentioned liquidity, some liquidity, but it might lower the numbers of intermediaries. What else might it do? 